If I catch you messing with your diet one more time, you're done for, young woman. You're a monster. <gasps> Don't you ever feed my child again, or you'll be fired. Chicken nuggets? Oh, you call this disgusting processed crap food? Oh. Do you think that your diet might have anything to do with your poor performance in PE? You can barely run. I, I don't know, um, yes? Good. The grease hasn't completely congealed your brain yet. I'm doing this for your own good, okay? <clears throat> <sighs> Lunch. What are you, a rabbit? Look, weird girl's a rabbit. Or maybe mommy and daddy can't actually afford food. Hey, what did I say earlier about making fun of people? Is this your whole lunch, Jackie? Hmm, you know, I don't think that's gonna be enough for you. We have a ton of activities left today. You're gonna need energy. You know why don't I give you my sandwich? I don't want your sandwich. No, it's okay. I insist. I said I don't want your sandwich. I get that. Have you ever suspected that one of your students isn't being fed well at home? Like, on purpose? I did have a case once. I reported it right away. You want my advice? Trust your gut. Open a file. Call the parents. Better be safe than sorry. Hi, Agatha. Hi. Is everything okay? Yes, everything's okay, miss. Can I see what you're hiding behind your back? Ooh, this is more than 13 months past the expiry. You know what, why don't I get you a new one? You, I saw your attempt to mess with my child in today vending machine food. Principal Leland, I was just trying to get her. Agatha is my daughter and you have no business feeding her processed snacks. Don't you know that there are seed oils in them? What are you trying to fatten her up like all the other loser kids? She was clearly hungry and I just thought I would get her something. So... I am Agatha's mother and only I get to decide what Agatha can and cannot eat. A little snack isn't gonna make much of a difference. No, no, I see what's happening here. You like to play mother with other people's children because you can't have your own. Pathetic. Well, let me break it to you. You're not a mother, you're a teacher. An infertile teacher who is interfering with my child's future. Agatha has a bright career in ballet waiting for her and you won't mess with it. Understood? As Agatha's teacher, it's my duty to speak up. She needs real food and she should not be on a diet. Don't look at her! Look at your own daughter. She looks sickly and she can barely focus in class. Don't tell me how to feed my daughter! If I catch you messing with your diet one more time, you're done for, young woman. Tomorrow is the Swan Lake audition and you better be the next Odette. You hear me? You're a monster. <gasps> 
<gasps> I will say it one last time. Don't you ever feed my child again or you'll be fired. And good luck trying to find a position elsewhere in Riverside. Mark my words. Enjoy the egg. Maybe it'll revive your dead womb. What were you thinking? Fatty moon cakes? You realize we're gonna have to skip dinner tonight, right? Turn around. They're not gonna cast a fat Odette, Agatha. You understand me? Ballerinas are airy, delicate, like a snow princess, okay? You move through the air like a beautiful bird. You wanna be a beautiful bird, don't you, sweetie? Yes, mommy. Come. I've reviewed the other candidates auditioning tomorrow. They don't stand a chance against you. You just need to stay strong, listen to mommy, and tomorrow, you will be Odette. Thank God you're here, Jackie. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. You never told me the student that you were worried about as Monica's daughter. What difference does it make? What difference does it make? All the difference. Don't mess with Monica. She could have us all fired and replaced in a heartbeat. So we're just supposed to stay silent? Hello, everyone. We're updating our maternity leave policy. Anyone who can or is able to have children in the future, please. We have a very special lunch waiting for you in room 415. I'd like to report my daughter missing. Please, 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 we have an audition in 15 minutes. She was supposed to wait for me. Yes, Agatha Leland. I last saw her in the corridor outside the back of the school. I knew this parent hasn't tried to steal my child because she can't have her own. She's jealous. Arrest her immediately. Well, she hasn't been kidnapped. She's still on school property. You're trying to poison my daughter. That grease is going to give her heart disease, not to mention the sodium, the ammonia. She wants my daughter fat and dead. She gave her a burger. Spit it out, sweetie, spit it out. Show me, show mommy, show me. Just show me down there, just show me. You can't do this to me. She's the one who stole my daughter. She's the one who took her. She's a criminal, not me. I didn't take her anywhere. We're still at school. I gave her some food because she's clearly starving. I'm setting her up for success, okay? You're ruining everything, everything! Now she's never gonna be the next so dead! Okay. Come on, honey, if we leave now, we can, we we can still us. make it to the audition. I think we got ourselves a starver. Starver, no, 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 I'm no, 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 I'm, 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 not, I'm not a starver. I'm a good mother, I'm a, I'm a good mother. I'm gonna escort you outside. We're gonna meet the CPS officer. Mama. They're gonna have a no, chat Agatha, with you. sweetie, look at me, look at me. Agatha, mommy loves you, mommy loves you, okay? Mommy loves you, don't listen to them. Mom, I just want to be a normal family again, like we were before Dad died. Almost as good as the ones Daddy used to make. <laughs> oh. 
I'm so sorry. I just miss him. <laughs> it's okay. Officer. Let's go. 